Uh, let's see here. You are 65 inches away from me, Josh. That is how far you stay away from me at all times. Let's answer some messages. Dear Jordan, my boyfriend doesn't know I exist, or at least he won't acknowledge my existence. What am I doing wrong? Have you spoken with him? Is this like one of those weird MySpace relationships? <laughs> Maybe his computer's broken. Maybe his computer got hacked. Maybe his MySpace account got deleted. Maybe you should try talking to him. Is it better to correct someone and help them better themselves or not correct them at all and let them going around looking like an idiot? Well, I've tried both with Josh and neither of them work. So plan C is to keep them 65 inches away from you at all times. <laughs> and so far that's not working either, but. Dear Jordan, if you had to choose between not being able to speak or not being able to move your eyebrows, which would you choose? Obviously, I would choose to not be able to speak. That is the only logical answer. Hey Jordan, I wanted to ask you, McGee and me or the magic school bus? Wow. That is a catch-22. McGee and me for moral lessons. Magic school bus so I can become smarter. Better person become a scientist for my purposes better person please don't let this be a normal field trip messages at blimeycow.com josh always beat me at pushing the a button fastest on those games at mario party i came up with a technique though you hold like this and you tense your it kind of hurts ow it actually really hurts your elbow but it's worth it when josh cries okay don't be messy and leave good messages